one. <laughs> Hello. Guess what? Pokio Skip is real. Pokio Skip is happening. And we're doing a run today. Super Mario Odyssey. The minimum amount of captures yesterday was 10. Now, a capture is, you know, taking control of an enemy with Cappy, right? That's a capture. And previously, it was thought that this Pokio had to be captured to climb this massive wall. Because, like, here. Like, look, look at this wall. It, it's, it's pretty obvious you need a Pokio to climb it, right? Well, it turns out that's not the case. It, it has been proven that it's possible in one player to do this trick. It's incredibly difficult, I would say. It's, it's difficult. Because one capture is able to be skipped, every single run on the minimum captures leaderboard is completely invalid. What you need to do to do this skip is go, like, half out of bounds and do some very tricky jumping to get all the way to the top here. It has been a bit since I have done this. Let's do this run. First ever nine caps. So it is in Japanese because Japanese is faster. We're going to start and switch to two player mode. First nine caps run is started. Let's go. If anyone doesn't know how difficult this run actually is, this whole run I am playing with my hands and my feet in two player mode. So I'm using my hands and my feet to press buttons with both Mario and Cappy. We need to go out of bounds in a bunch of different places. We need to do a bunch of glitches to skip a bunch of other captures. The first difficult, really truly difficult trick is in Cascade Kingdom, so we will be doing that. But let's get going. So first kingdom, here we go. Now don't expect this run to be great because it's been like months since I've done minimum captures. Because I kind of burned out from it a little bit because... I wasn't really making any big progress, but now, now it's very exciting. Okay, so first capture to be skipped is the frog right there. That's an intended capture, but we are going to skip that by doing that jump there. Not an easy jump, for sure. I still got it. I still got it. Let's go. First capture. Stuff. All right. First kingdom down. One capture. That wire. That is the first capture. Now, Cascade Kingdom doesn't have any captures because it has some really insane stuff. And you're about to see it. So hopefully I remember how to do all this stuff. We'll see. First thing we got to do in Cascade Kingdom is go out of bounds. <laughs> Not working completely properly. There we go. We're out of bounds, boys. Alright, now we go here. We get this moon right in here. Just like so. A very truly amazing moment. And now from here, we do a blind jump across. Ah, I went back in bounds. But it isn't easy, I'll tell you that. There we go. We got it. Okay, now we have to go back here. Gotta do a very tricky jump to get up into that pipe. There we go. We're in. Got that moon. It's moon number two. Now for the hard part. I have to play very, very well with both of my hands and my feet at the same time. I have not done this in a long time. Alright, failed it on the first try. That's okay. What I need to do is play with my hands and feet to get Cappy up onto the island in the sky to get to that checkpoint. That island in the sky that's right over there, we need to get Cappy on that. That's what I'm trying to do right now. Here we go. Let's do it. Here we go. That's high enough. Be on. Yep, that's on the island. Good. Why is that not working? I, that usually works. I used to get this, like, first or second try every time. Now look at me. Washed up speedrunner. Tries to relive his glory days. 
Okay. Good! You don't try it. We got it! Good! That was right. <laughs> okay! We got it! Only took 20 minutes! <laughs> got that moon, good! Went through the wall to get that moon. Now, what I'm doing right now, why I need to get all of these moons, is because it skips Madame Brutal, and Madame Brutal is three captures. So that is why I'm going through all of this mess to do all of these tricks. Because I am trying to skip Madame Brutal. And we have just skipped the Madame Brutal boss fight. By getting all of the moons that are possible to get in Cascade Kingdom. Without capturing anything. What is the route again? I'm trying to remember the route for this run, because it's been so long since I've done it. It's been a hot minute, dude. One, two, I think this was the route. God, I can't remember. <laughs> Okay, now we do the clip, which is very difficult. Hopefully I can get it easily enough. Let's see. Stand about there. We can always give up on it, too. It's not actually that big of a deal to give up on it. But we don't need to, because we're through. Alright, now we switch back to two-player mode. That clip is incredibly difficult in two-player mode, which is why I choose not to do it in two-player mode. But there we go. And we will grab this moon, half out of bounds, good stuff. It's so weird, the day that I wanted to do minimum captures again was on Friday. And today, a new minimum captures was discovered. So like, the next time I, I burn out and then want to do minimum captures again, is probably the next time that a new capture will be discovered. <laughs> Alright, finish this off. No captures in this kingdom still. Like, we had no captures in sand, no captures in this kingdom. We're all good. And back him again. There we go. There we go. Good stuff. Just a serious practice run. It's just practice. It's the first time this has ever been done, but you know it's just practice. You know it's just practice. Come on. Alright. Not great movement. It's because I am... Still a bit rusty, but that's okay. There we go. Yo, Steph, thanks for the 10 months. Not caps is the thing now? Yes. We're doing the first one, baby. Yeah, for anyone that isn't aware, that Bowser's hat is not a capture because you're not transforming into it with Cappy. You're just taking control of it. It's not a capture. But a capture is when you transform into something. You're not transforming into a hat. You're just wearing it. That was the softest ground pound you'll ever see. <laughs> he just tapped his little toes onto the ground and was good to go, man. No. Okay. You know what? We'll do the safe strat, apparently. Because he didn't want to time it right, that's okay. We're rolling. Skipping the wire capture to get into Metro Kingdom. Now we're gonna climb up this real fast. Gonna go over here and go all the way up. Let's go. That one. Nice. Now this is... The second capture in the run. You have to capture this tank to be able to defeat this boss fight. Currently, this capture is 100% required. There is no working theories whether this can be skipped or not, but this is the most likely capture to be skipped if another one were to be skipped in the future. Do this little clip real quick, just a, a zip on by. Whoop, there we go. <laughs> Skip the capture for the RC car, love that. Great. Oh, first try, baby. First try. Let's go. Two-player dram. That's not easy. <laughs> that is not easy, my man. Playing with my hands and feet at the same time. I have a lot of energy today. I'm excited, Slumdog Billionaire. I am excited. It's the first freaking... It's it's minimum captures. It lost its luster because I kind of killed it because it's stupid difficult. And now it's even more stupider difficulter. Yes, that's English. I swear. Like, history is currently being made. This has been a thing that has been theorized for so, so long. Like, right 
when I was doing the 10 captures run, people were asking, okay, but what's next? What what captures most likely to be skipped after that? I said the Pokio is most likely to be skipped. Well, here we are. Pokio has been skipped. Now, Beach Kingdom. I mm, I can't remember the route. <laughs> what do you do for this kingdom? Uh Alright, Seaside is a really cool one, I forgot. Let's go. Yeah, Seaside has some really cool strats. If I can remember how to do it properly, you guys are in to see something real sick. Alright, check this out, check this out. One. Please, Mario. Bomb. Bomb. Sick, right? Is that not the coolest thing? You've seen all day. Just climbing up a wall. I'm the coolest thing you've seen all day. You know it. You're absolutely right. I look like one of those streamers with a weird gimmick. Yeah. <laughs> Don't worry, my weird gimmick is dumb challenges. That's my gimmick. I just do dumb stuff on stream, but it's really fun. Alright, seaside's over. We're cruising. I can't exactly remember the movement for this, but hopefully I get it. That'll do. Now just a reminder, Scarecrows, I don't transform into them, so that is not a capture. Yeah, the Scarecrow is borrowing my hat, but when I capture, I borrow the enemy's life permanently. That's all it is. Alright, cruising through. Are you guys ready for the dance break? All right, <laughs> we're done. Technically, I can skip the dance break if I was uh, good enough, but we can't skip the dance break. We can't. This next kingdom is the third capture in the entire run. If we happen to die on the Rune Dragon fight, the run is dead. I'm not sure if I've ever died to the Rune Dragon fight though, so we really don't have much risk. All right, capture number three. That wire right there. Uh oh. Uh oh. We get hit by one of these electric boys, it's over. No, it was fine. <laughs> I just wanted to add some pressure to the run. Just wanted to give you guys some some you know, be more engaged. What if he dies? What happens? Oh no. It's all good. No risk whatsoever. Now we got Bowser's Kingdom, the one with all the captures. All right, let's count them down. Capture number four, right there. Uh, yeah, I couldn't remember the skip. Capture number five now. All right, we're gonna go talk to our friendly ogre. Because this, his little brother, is actually gonna help us skip the Pokio. Let's go. Capture number six, I believe. There we go. And we cannot capture this Pokio, but we do need the shard. So we're gonna have to have them do a little dance for us, just like that. Perfect. Watching this on YouTube, wanna see your content more? How would I do that? If you're watching this on YouTube and you wanna see my content more, Retro Remedies, you hit that subscribe button, all right? That's all you gotta do. All right, that's number seven. This wire is number eight. Alright, it looks like the chat box broke, guys. It will fix itself in a few minutes. Gotta love that internet, right? Now we gotta do the trick. Okay, we're out of bounds. Half out of bounds. Now we need to climb this wall. Okay, get a good camera angle. One, two... Ah, uh, we're dead. Good start! <laughs> good start. Let's try this trick again. It's kind of weird with the camera half in the wall, you know? Alright, first step is done. Second step done. Third step is done. Okay. Okay. Ah, I missed it. Okay. Unfortunately, 
There's no checkpoint up there, so we gotta climb all the way back up. This is it. This is the skip that we've been trying to find for, like, months, years. It's basically since the game came out. <laughs> Oh, missed the invisible ledge. All right. Back on this. Around the corner. And we're up. Good. Ah, I did it again. It took so long for Cabby to come back. That's okay. There you go. <laughs> he went through, man. With my heart rate now on a 1 to 180 scale, uh, heart rate going around 130, I would say. It's it's pretty pretty up there, considering it rests at like 80 almost all the time. My mom's resting heart rate is 67. Oh my god, mom, you're so close to greatness. I mean, when you were doing the test, you couldn't have like bre breathed in a little faster. And so what? <laughs> Getting directly on the platform from the invisible one is 100% easier. All right, I will try that. I think right side of the wall is easier to clip through. You think? All right, we'll try right side of the wall, see if that's easier. Hey, maybe you're right. We're up! We got it! Okay! I tried the triple jump just on a whim to see if it would work. We're up, we're up, we're up, we're up! Okay, 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 okay! Okay! Good, now... I just need to get the two-player jump. Just gotta get two-player. Got it! We got it! We've done it! We've skipped the Pokio! Let's go! Alright! Let's do this thing! Are you ready, boys? Are you ready? We're taking this nut! We're taking the nut! And we're getting it... wet! <laughs> and now, the hardest part about the run is with the wet nut jump, I have to do a trick where you have to throw the nut and catch it and you have to press a button within two or three frames like 40 times in a row without ever messing up. If you mess up, you restart from the beginning. You die. Here we go, all right. Let's do this thing. Let's do this. All right, stand here you go. One, two. I still got it. I still got it. That is the wet nut jump. That was level two. Now we need to go all the way up. We need to go all the way up. Like, like all the way up. So it may take a few tries, but we're gonna get it. Okay, alright. Gonna have to focus harder than that. Come on, hands. You can do it. Focus. Heck. Alright. Messed up the timing a little bit there. That's okay. Get up there, Mario. What are you doing? Why does that have to be wet? I, it's a very good question. I don't know, man. I ask myself that every day. What's the combo for the nut jump? You just... Throw and dive, throw, dive, throw, dive. But it's very, very precise timing. Visualize success, visualize finishing. Nutting straight onto Bowser's head. I'm visualizing it. Looks good to me. We've got this. It's what I want, it's what I need. Am I insane? I'm not insane, actually, no. I am not insane. I'm nuts. Three, two. One, nut. You do not need to be stressed, okay. I will not be stressed. Okay, here we go. Okay, 
There we go! The nut jump has been done! Let's go! But the run isn't over yet. Still need to do the big boy jump to get off of this head. Which is a very difficult jump. Very precise. And I've died on it before. Haven't done it in four months, so... We'll see how it goes. See if I can get it. And we're up! There we go! Nine caps run is on its way. Just gotta do the mech. Look at that, baby. Smooth! We're speed running, boys! It's happening! It did take a little bit of time, but honestly, not too bad considering everything. Go! Oh. <laughs> Not a big deal. Because the boss fight's over! Good backups! There you go! Let's go! Finish this thing off. We're making history. Three, nine captures is real! What is happening to ten caps? All of the records getting removed. There's no point in having them anymore. It's nine caps now. Alright! We're finishing this thing off! Ah. Thought I was an ant, not the goat. Well, sorry to, to change your whole opinions, but here we are. Okay, one, two, three. All right, I think this is a fantastic opportunity today. Because you, know, you guys know what's coming up, right? And I think this is an opportunity to be the greatest XD we have ever seen. Wait for it, wait for it. Hold. We got to do 2D skip first. 2D, wait, wait, wait. No! <laughs> no! We get to do it again. That's what the kids these days are calling DX skip. Alright, I'm just gonna do regular XD then. The classic XD! <laughs> XD, guys. Let's go. <laughs> Look at all of them. Beautiful. Keep them coming. Fill the XDs. Let's go. Whoa. Oh my god. Look at the chat. It cannot keep up. <laughs> all right. The very first. Nine captures completion and speedrun of Super Mario Odyssey. Done. In two hours, ten minutes, and fifteen seconds. There you go. <laughs> ten caps is dead. Long live nine caps. Oh my god. Well, that is not all. Alright? Because of this new discovery. That means that every single minimum captures category, the boards will most likely be completely wiped. This means that there are three more categories that do not have a single run in them yet. No one has ever done them. On to the next world record we're gonna get today. And we're starting. Let's go. Minimum captures one player. This is 12 captures. What's the difference between 12 caps and 9 caps? I will tell you in a moment once I'm done with this, uh, this room real quick. Three captures. <laughs> you menace? What do you mean? Wait, why do a 12 cap run? Because 12 captures is the minimum captures you can get in one player. And this is one player Pokyo skip, so it is harder than the last one. But the, the real challenge in the run starts now. Is this the last run for today? I'm not sure. We'll see. All right, now we one, two, three. Oh, 
There we go. We're up, baby. We got it. Pokio skip one player in a run. It's alive. We're going, dude. All right, we did it. We did it. <laughs> Pokio skip is so hard. Yeah, it is. We've done it. We got the nut jump. Let's go. All right, but now it's not over. It's not over. There we go. That's right. There we go. 12 captures. It's on its way. Do I want to redo nine? I'm not going to redo nine today. Next week, I will be dedicating most of the week to minimum captures. Monday, Tuesday, and Friday. I think next week we'll do minimum captures just to be able to to get the record down to a point where it is very difficult to beat. All right, there's 2D, wait for it. We're getting XD. We're gonna do true XD this run. XD! All of the XDs, baby. Fill it up, fill it up. Let's go. A 12 captures run, the first one. One hour, 49 minutes, 18 seconds. It has been done. Now, obviously, these runs suck. I am going to take these down over and over and over again to the point where hopefully no one ever even wants to try. That is the goal. We're going to do that next week. Monday, Tuesday, and Friday most likely. Um, tomorrow...